As a TBI survivor, what's the best ear protection for reducing sound? I'll let you know what I think, coming up. The world is noisy. We've got loud restaurants, concerts that get pretty loud, dense city life, family events can get pretty hectic, even your kids events. You know, my daughter goes to, uh, she has swim meets every, every weekend and it get pretty, gets pretty loud and echoey in there. So uh, yeah, the world is noisy. As a TBI survivor, one of my major symptoms is sensory overload, specifically my ears and hearing. So today we're gonna go over a few products that I've tried. Some of them have worked for me, some of them have not. That doesn't mean it's not gonna work for you. So let's go over them. First, we're gonna start off with the uh, Noise Fidelity earplugs, specifically the Vibes first. We're gonna start with that. Um, this one has a noise reduction rating, which is a reduction in sound or decibels of 15. Mm -hmm. These are specifically for um, enhancing sound of concerts and stuff like that. Um, I tried to use them in an indoor swim meet. It didn't quite work for me. It kind of enhanced the shouting of the parents. So I didn't quite, you know, it didn't work for me. But the nice things about these, they're low profile. They're a bit of a minimalist design, so they're very small. So when we open it, we'll, we'll take a look at it. And it also comes with two different uh, silicone uh, sizes for different ears. If you have big ear canals, you can use a larger one. If you have small ones like me, you can use the, uh, of course, the smaller one. So let's open this up. It comes in this cool box, orange and black, little flip cover. Boom, here's the, uh, the product inside. Here you go. Now we're gonna pop this out. Here's the two little ear plugs right there. Right now they're set for the, the smaller silicone uh, attachments at the end for the smaller ear canals. It's made out of plastic and silicone. Again, I've used these um, in, in, in a swim meet and they didn't quite work for me. You kind of got to shove them in your ear a little bit, maybe twist them, but I couldn't really get a good fit. And again, they, uh, they increase the sound quality of what's around you. <laughs> so if you're looking for sound reduction, probably not the best product, if that's what you're looking for. For me, I'm looking for silence and um, a, a large reduction in, in, in noise in the environment. So maybe for someone to go to a concert, or, or a speaking event, these might work best for you. And also it comes with a little case in here. You pop out, it's right there. Pop out. Little vibes case. Little vibes on the top. Pop them out. Here's a little baggie. Here's the, uh, oh, actually it comes with two other sizes for ear canals. So if you have large, medium, or small. Here we go. That's my review of the, uh, the the vibes. Again, didn't work for me. Doesn't mean it won't work for you. Depends what you're looking for. Next product we're gonna review is the Eargasm earplugs. High fidelity again. Decibel reduction of 16 on these. Again, uh, these are specifically for concerts and speaking events. Um, here are the earplugs right here. Comes with a little nice little case, metal case for your key, chain, or backpack and um, another set of uh, silicone tips. I think leave out a different size in case your ears are smaller or bigger. Here are the ear plugs there. The blue part is the sound attenuation filter and the rest are the silicone tips right there. These are much larger than the vibes. Let me bring in the vibes. You can get a sound or a size comparison. See the vibes are a little bit more uh, minimalist. And these are a lot bigger, but uh, bigger is not always better, right? No? I had a tough time putting these in my ears. Felt like they kept, kept wanting to pop out, and I believe this is a smaller silicone. Again, it, it enhanced sound. It enhanced all the screaming uh, parents and, and children and all that stuff at the swim meet. I didn't like them quite too much. Doesn't mean it, will, it won't work for you, but that's uh, a quick review of that one. Much bigger. The next one I'm going to review is the 3M Peltor. I've had these for a couple of years. They're made by 3M. They're over-the-ear muffs. They have a sound reduction of 27 decibels. I specifically use these for woodworking. You can also take them to a race car race or an indoor concert too. But again, as you can see, they're kind of bulky. Um, but they're comfortable. I've used these at a swim meet before. They've uh, They've reduced the sound quite a bit. 
Let me try them out for you. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, they're comfortable, uh, especially with glasses. But these are my go-to for, for woodworking specifically. I got these on, on Amazon and it, it's, a, it's a great product. Uh, I'll probably get another one once these start to wear out. But they're, they're highly adjustable. You probably use these at like football games too. Put a nice logo on there. But they're made out of plastic. Got these nice comfortable foam ear liners here. So I believe they only come in black. I'd have to double check. But uh, I have a nice case for it. Nice little case that I, I pop it open. They fit perfectly in here. Bam, zips up, pop them in your bag. Protects them so they don't get damaged. But I keep these in the garage whenever I'm cutting wood or routing out some stuff. But those are my uh, 3M Peltor. Very comfortable. So. When I built this case behind me, these came in handy. These earmuffs came in handy. All the routing and the cutting, uh, track saw, routers, they get pretty loud, so those are uh, lifesavers for, uh, for woodworking. All right, the last product I'm gonna be reviewing is the Max earplugs. These are my go-to everyday earplugs. Their foam earplugs have a decibel reduction rating of 32, comes in a pack of 50. And it's uh, about nine bucks on Amazon. These are my go-to. I put these everywhere. I put them in little uh, medicine baggies. Okay. Little medicine baggies. And I stick them in my pocket. I stick them in my book bag. I stick them in my car. And I stick it in my wife's purse. My daughter's purse. <laughs> stick it everywhere. Again, foam, nude color. These are just, again, my go-to. Squeeze them, just pop them in your ear. Carry them with me everywhere. Yeah. Pop them, see, squeeze them. Pop them in here. Put them in right now. Mm -hmm. Roll them. Pop them in my ear. Yeah. Uh, total silence. Yes. Don't hear a thing. I use these at work. I use these at uh, construction uh, sites when I go at, at, at my work. I use these at restaurants. I don't use them driving. It's dangerous. But I use these every, everywhere else. I need to uh, reduce the sound of my environment. Yes. So these are Max. Highly recommend these. Again, get a little baggy, medicine baggy. Stick a couple pairs here and there in case you need them. These are lifesavers. I've, I've used these for the past five years. I can really hear myself. Let me take that out. These are comfortable because uh, they're they're light, they're soft. They they go in my ear canal and and they expand. And the other products, they're 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 rubbery, they're silicone-y. They quite, don't quite fit my ear ear canals. I have a smaller ear canal. They come in different colors. You can you can search on Amazon or any online retailer, but they come in, in, in highlighter green and yellow and pink and stuff like that. I've used other foam earplugs. Um, they don't. Some of them don't quite have the same uh, decibel reduction. I believe there's another one out there that's that's rated for uh, for for 35 decibel rating reduction but it's, it's highlighter green. These are the only ones that have a 32 decibel ratings that, that come in new that I can find. Again, they come in packs of, this one's 50, love them. So, highly recommend these, get them, stick them everywhere. Question of the day, do you guys use these products? If so, what are your thoughts? If not, what do you guys recommend? I would love to hear from you guys, whether you're a TBI survivor or just someone looking for a good hearing protection. Please leave your comments below, love to hear from you guys. All right, that's my review of the Vibes, Eargasms, Max, and 3M. Max are still my favorites. Again, thanks for watching this video. Hope you liked it. Hit that like button if you do. If you love it, please subscribe. Thanks again. Uh, hope to see you in the next video. Peace. As a TBI survivor, what's the best ear protection for reducing sound? I'll let you know. Coming up. How about that one? <laughs> God. One of my major symptoms uh, as a TBI survivor is sensory overload. Specifically, me and my. <laughs> <laughs> you like that? <laughs> okay, I'm flowing. I'm gonna flow. I'm gonna flow. Listen, All right. Listen up. Wow, wow, wow. All right. Ah, yeah. So uh, we'll go over these products uh, one by one and uh, let you know what we think. What I think. I'll let you know what what I thought.
I'll let you know what I think. But I thunk it? <laughs> I'll let you know what I thunk it. Okay, do that over again, huh? I have a small ear canal, so they don't quite fit my ear. These are foam and they're expanding and they just plug up my hole, my ear hole. <laughs> <laughs> they plug my ear hole. They plug your hole. They plug my hole in my ear, my ear holes. Really tightly. <laughs> <laughs> they, pl they plug your holes. So if you're looking to plug your holes in your ears, I highly recommend Max.